previously on The Walking Dead. I can't even take care of myself. How am I supposed to raise a child? I wasn't truthful when I came across y'all at the lodge. Now folks are dead, and I can't help but feel I'm to blame. When you cover yourself in their smell, rub the walker guts all over you. They can't tell you from one of them. You just have to keep calm and make sure you're good and covered. Go on. You don't need to see this. I'm not going anywhere. Dead yet. We'll, we'll figure something out. We have to get out of here. Oh, God! Serena! Oh, shit. She's, She's gonna be okay. You're gonna be okay. Come on. We have to move. We have to. Anybody. I know. What do we do? Mope was with me, but we're still covered in walker guts. Look, the walkers are still moving toward the hardware store. We can make it out if we stick to. I'm glad you're here. We can watch each other's back. I'll stick with you. Thank you. They're thinning out somewhere. Do you see any openings? Anything? Clem, we've got to hurry. There. Damn it! Go back, go back! Jane! Jane, thank God. Stop. Relax. You need to walk slowly. You'll be fine. I can't do this. You have to help us. 
<laughs> we can't come together like this. It's better if we spread out. You two will be fine. No, you don't understand. Just help us. If you think we should spread out, we'll spread out. You said you would stay with me. Push through that cluster of walkers. They're so pretty. We'll make a cow catcher. Just we need. We should just run for or it. Or you could shut up and pay attention. Let's see. There. That one looks light enough to carry. I'm gonna get on the far side of her. I need you to get her attention. anybody now are you follow me stay close if you fall behind I can't come back for you We need to keep going. I mean, we're almost there, right? I hope so. It's getting so damn cold. Wish I could stop, but I can't. Not until we're with the others. I need to make sure everyone else made it out. Luke, Sarah, Kenny. God damn it. What if they aren't there? If they aren't, nothing we can do about it. Don't even say things like that. Fine. Jesus, I don't even know if we're safe. What if the herd is still following us? We're fine. It's been quiet, but who knows? Don't worry. We're okay. We'll meet up with everyone soon. We'll at least be safe, I guess. We need to keep up a good pace. I know. I know. Just, I'm going as fast as I can. I know I should feel glad that we escaped, but I just can't stop thinking about the others. It was stupid. What was? Escaping? Look, I know we all agreed to use the herd to get out, but maybe we should have been more patient. Come up with something better. It worked. If you can call that working, we could have... I don't know. Jane saved us. I don't know how we would have gotten out without you. You don't give yourself enough credit. I'm just saying that if people hadn't panicked, Things might have turned out better. Of course. We panicked. We were scared. The plan was good. The execution was the messy part. That sounds an awful lot like you're saying it was their fault. What? No. No, that's not what I'm saying. Just... Ugh. I have to stop. I'm sorry. I don't want to slow us down. Can I just have a minute? Uh, yeah. Take a minute. Thank you. Alvin was supposed to be here for this. Is Alvin... He's dead is what he is. Thanks to that fucking madman back there. Kenny might know what to do. 
He had a family. Let's hope he made it to the meetup point then. What are you going to do with it? What do you mean by that? Uh, I'm sorry. Just making conversation. It was nothing. No. What do you mean by that? Do with what? My baby? I'm just looking at the worst case scenario. You and Clem won't be able to raise a baby by yourselves. Not out here. I just mean it's going to need food and, you know, other stuff. Guys, that baby is coming, like it or not. Fine. And then what? It's going to be helpless, and you can't protect it. And you assume I won't be capable enough. Just because you're some angry loner who doesn't care about anyone but herself doesn't mean you know better than me. Hey, I've seen it before. Back when it started, me and my sister, we what? were... She died? I don't need your pity. You don't... You don't have the right... Jane! Shit, I didn't mean that. She didn't mean it. Right? Oh, damn it. We can't just sit here doing nothing. I know, I know. They'll be here soon. Holy shit. It had been so long. We were starting to worry no one else would make it. Well. Besides, how's Sarita? I tried to talk to Jane. He flipped out on me. Started yelling. Scary shit. I know. He probably didn't mean it. But it was scary. I hate to say it. But Sarita's on her way out. She's probably going to turn soon. Is, uh, is he gonna take care of her? Jane! I know it's not pretty, but it's better than the alternative. It's not our decision to make. But it's the one that's gotta be made. We're already up the creek enough without a walker to worry about. Just let me talk to him first. It's all right, Sarita. It's gonna be okay. I'm gonna be here with you. Right till the end. Hi, Kenny. You think I don't know what y'all are whispering about over there? I said we just wanted a little fucking time alone to say goodbye. <gasps> shh, shh, shh. It's okay, babe. It's okay. We're gonna get through this. We're gonna do what we gotta do. Gonna play the shit hand that this shit world dealt us. Kenny, I'm so sorry about you Sarita. You that, babe? Clem says she's sorry. Don't that make you feel better? <clears throat> Being angry won't help anything. No, because it's sure as hell helping me. I tried to save look her. At her. I said, look at her. She is going to die because of you. You think because you're a little girl, you can just get people killed and no one will care? That because you're sorry, it'll all magically go away? That's not how it works. Now for the last time, just leave us alone. To say goodbye. I'm going crazy just sitting here not doing anything. Just give it time, Mike. It's still early. Clem, how'd it go? Kenny's really mad at me. Clem, you can't just expect him to bounce back. That man's going through. At least you try. Still, it doesn't exactly help us figure out what we're gonna do now. We got no food, no water. It's getting damn cold, and we're losing daylight fast. When the others get back, they'll know what to do. 
Luke will have a plan. I thought Kenny would have a plan. Mike, Bonnie. <sighs> Mike's got a point. You can't just keep sitting around waiting. Things are difficult enough right now, and soon you'll have a baby on your hands, too. What? Suddenly you're pretending to be concerned? We should go find Luke, Sarah, and Nick. If they're in trouble, we might be able to help them. Clementine's right. After everything, after all this, if there's any chance they're still alive, we need to take it. I'll go. Clem can come with me. Thank you. Listen, Rebecca, if anything goes wrong here, you got something to protect yourself? I've got this. You don't think I'd need to... I don't know, but you better keep that close. Come on, Clem. <laughs> 